I'm super excited you reached out to see what the heck I do that I always have five or more in place. Seriously, every single day I'm communicating with at least five or more. I wanna just read this statistic again, okay? It says, believe it or not, if you just invited one, one, one person a day for 90 days to take a look, to take a look at secret, okay? If you just invited one person a day for 90 days to take a look at secret, you would be doing more than 95% of the people. I want that to digest because sometimes we beat ourselves up and we wonder why we're not having more success. It is a numbers game. You've heard it a million times, but I really, really want you to hear it. So make a commitment for the next 90 days to talk to at least one new person a day. Okay, so I said to text me or private message me for nuggets. Here's my four nuggets about this. Number one, you cannot prejudge anyone. Every single one of you watching this are prejudging people. Every single one of you watching this has people around you you have not talked to for some crazy reason that's in your mind. I am so thankful that Mike Roy did not prejudge Brian and I. He picked up the phone and he said, hey, I'd like you to take a look at something. Will you watch a video? That's number one. You all have people you're prejudging and you know me, so I'm just gonna say that's not being very nice. Every single person you know has the right to be asked if they wanna take a look at secret. And then you share the videos. If they live near us, we get in front of them. If they don't live near us, get them the videos. That simple. Bullet point number two. Some of you are just like spamming people. You're just texting people without having some kind of conversation. So how do I always have five people in play? I send some kind of conversation. Hey, how are you? How are the kids? How are the dog? I saw you got a new job on Facebook. I saw you had a flat tire last night. Oh my gosh, I saw you selling your house. Whatever kind of communication. Or I was just driving you know, across town. I drove by your neighborhood and I thought of you. How are you? Have a couple of sentences of communication. Pick up the phone or text or Facebook a couple sentences of communication, ask for permission to send the video. Otherwise, you're just spamming. If you don't have people responding to you when you share the videos, you're just spamming. These are reasons that I always have five or more in play. Okay, number three, you have to write people's names down. You have to write them down. If you don't write them down, what you're just saying to the world is they're not important enough. And I know that sounds silly, and if you're, you're new, you're like, you're just silly, Michelle. I'm not. You have to write down, okay? Hmm, who haven't I sh shared with before? Janet Sewell. This is someone I've never shared with before. She's kind of on my chicken list, so I'm telling you that. Who else is someone I've never shared with? I just saw on Facebook a guy I went to high school with. His name's Troy Dunlap. I actually just saw that he was doing construction, and he was showing a picture of his house he's building. Those are two names, and we're saying one or more a day. I do five or more a day. I'm telling you, at least one or more a day. Okay, the last bullet point, this could be the biggest, You've got to revisit people. If you've been around a 90 day chunk, seriously, and you asked someone last September, last October, last November, a gazillion things have changed. If I said to you, hey, what were you wearing on October 17th? You'd be like, I don't know. If I said to you, hey, we talked to each other on October 18th, what did we talk about? You'd be like, I don't know. So don't have it in your head that every single person remembers. I. Actually, I've shared with people and asked them to watch a video. I went back, bullet point number four, I revisited them, and they said, you never asked me before. I'm like, I did, you crazy busy person. So don't prejudge. You gotta have some kind of conversation if you're texting out videos or Facebooking videos first. Bullet point number three then is you gotta write people's names down. If you don't write down people's names, it's not real, it doesn't happen, you're not being nice, you're saying you don't care about other people, and I know that's not you. And then bullet point number four is you've got to revisit your list. There are people you shared with from the past that we could go back and revisit, and say, hey, I was just thinking about you, we never finished the conversation, I don't know if you ever watched it or if they're in your neighborhood, invite them over to your house. Okay, that's as fast as I could go before my time ran up. Thanks for messaging me and go be the 5% that do one or more a day for a 90 day straight period.